Morgan, we we started dating over five and a half years ago. Um, on February 15th, 2017, I asked you to be my girlfriend. And uh, I don't exactly remember how it went. I just knew that I could not wait another way to do another day to do it, even though Valentine's Day was the next day. Uh, we've always known that we would spend the rest of our lives together and knew that we were high school sweethearts, as people would say. As I stand here today, I'm 100% sure that, that we're soulmates and I cannot imagine a life spent without you on my side. God could not have created a more perfect fit in person for me. Um, and first, I'd like to promise to always be there for you and, and have your back through every situation. I promise to be a loving, caring, and encouraging husband and one day father. I promise to appreciate every second I spend with you and always value our time. I promise to always value growing together as partners and giving you my best. Lastly, I promise to love you unconditionally for the rest of our lives. Nate, for over five years, you have been not only my partner, but also my best friend. You are the most important life person in my life. If something happens, you are who I want to tell. When I need someone to confide in, you're the person I turn to. I know God purposely created and placed you into my life for a reason. Nobody has ever made me feel more heard, respected, appreciated, valued, comforted, encouraged, and loved the way that you do. You keep me accountable and continue to push me to be a better version of myself, and I thank you for being you. I promise to put you first and be by your side in time of need. I promise to watch football with you <laughs> and cheer the Titans on after every big win. I promise to encourage you, push you, and stand by your side with support no matter what. I promise to be your wife, your best friend, and one day another of your children. As we stand here, I can say I don't know exactly what the future holds for us, but I do know that I can't imagine one without you in it. Nate, you are loved beyond measure, and I will make a constant effort to make sure you know that every day. As we, sorry. Lastly, I love you unconditionally and cherish you completely from this moment until my very last. And now, in the sight of God, in this beautiful sunny day, in this beautiful Mexican paradise, I am honored to pronounce you husband and wife. Nathaniel, you may now kiss your bride.